As officers arrived, they came, they be, they came in contact with an active shooter incident. We haven't heard nothing. We called the hospitals. They said they couldn't tell us anything. And we just waiting. Breaking now, nine people are dead. Several others are injured after a mass shooting in Indianapolis. CBS4 has team coverage this morning. We're live at the scene on the city's southwest side. All of this at a FedEx facility. This morning, we're getting right into it. I'm Angela Brower. Hey, uh, I'm Nick McGill. This all started around 11 o'clock last night when IMPD responded to a shot fired call along Mirabelle Road. And Nick, again, that's where detectives found nine people dead, including the suspected gunman. He allegedly took his own life. IMPD not willing to say how many people were hurt just yet, although they said several went to the hospital by ambulance. At least one person is now in critical condition. IMPD has not yet identified the person responsible for this, nor have they pinpointed a motive. Police are asking for the public's patience as they investigate. And you know, in the Indianapolis Metropolitan Police Department, the officers responded. They came in, they went in and they did their job. And a lot of them are trying to face this because this is a site that no one should ever have to see. But we, as Indianapolis members, need to come together. We need to support each other and understand that there are going to be people out there that are going to be emotionally upset and we need to support them. Family members have gathered at the Holiday Inn Express nearby. They are desperately waiting for answers as well.